Our devotion for this week is entitled Clean Hands, Pure Heart by Rev. Alexander Uy. Take time to read Matthew chapter 15, verses 1 to 20. Jesus was confronted by the Pharisees because of his disciples' failure to observe the ritual of hand washing before eating. While the washing of hands may be important nowadays as this keeps us in good health, and especially in light of the COVID-19 virus, the Pharisees of Jesus' day made it into a ceremonial ritual, of which failure of observance was frowned upon because it was deemed to be a sin. The Pharisees had elevated a man-made tradition into a law equal with God's law. On the other hand, the Pharisees had made God's law be filled with exceptions, and Jesus cited the law of honoring one's parents as an example. The Pharisees had put in so many exceptions to the rules to suit what they wanted to do instead, so that they, technically, did not violate the law. For Jesus, however, eating with unwashed hands wouldn't defile anyone where it mattered most, in their relationship with God. Real defilement comes from what we say out loud and what we do, when it comes from an evil and unregenerate heart. The Pharisees had mastered the art of majoring on the unimportant, and they failed to recognize how far they have drifted from God and His will. I will have to admit that I have not always been careful with my heart. My words sometimes hurt others. My disposition sometimes reflect a lack of faith in Christ or a joyless Christianity. Admittedly, I need to constantly renew my heart and mind to let what is good fill my heart so that what comes out is also good. Holy Spirit, fill me with goodness that comes from you, so that my mouth and my hands may speak and do that which is good.